Gentlemen, and those of you who do not, strictly speaking, fit either of those descriptions, welcome back to Let's Play Fallout New Vegas. It's been a while, I know. The reason for this is that Russell ate a sort of rad roach vindaloo last night, and he had to go to the toilet, and we've been here for quite some time now, and he's only just got back. So, basically, blame him. Welcome back, everybody. All right. Now, you may have forgotten in the long lavatory break that just ensued what exactly we are doing here. We're, uh, we're in the Vegas Strip at the minute. We're in the we're in Michelangelo's uh, sign shop, which has clearly seen better days. And uh, we're here because we need, need to get some flashy signs for um, our new casino. And that is why we are here. But apparently Michelangelo is being a big wuss and doesn't feel like making signs. So we've come here to uh, sort him out. All of us. Including the robot dog. I, uh, you know. Hello. Hi. Hi. What can I do for you? Um, yeah, I'm, what is this place? I'm assuming I'm in the right, I'm, I'm in the right spot. Hopefully. Right building. You saw our front sign, didn't you? This is where all the beautiful signs of the strip become a reality. It all comes from Michelangelo's imagination. We do a little work here and there too, sure, but he's the real artist. Who is Michelangelo? He's the reason the strip shines like a star at night. Mike's imagined and built every sign, billboard, and light you'll see around here. Uh, where can I find him? Check out the back of the shop. He's usually working there. Uh-huh. And how long have you worked here? I've been here over a year now. No, I'm not one to get tired for long. I plan to roam the wasteland once I'm ready. The people need light and kindness. There's too much fear and pain out there already. Right. Okay. Well, bye-bye. Bye. Good luck with that. Moving swiftly on. Oh my, oh my word. It's actually quite big in here. This is sort of impressive, isn't it? Although I'm not really sure why you need a building like this. That's, that's so flipping big. What's in here anyway? Tool cabinet. A bunch of old equipment. <gasps> Ooh. 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 Do you think anyone will notice if I just... Oh, just go on. What does this do then? Uh, well. Boring. I was expecting a big bang and everything to go boo and... Uh, never mind. <sighs> How dreadfully dull. Moving swiftly on. Let's go and talk to this idiot. Hello. Oh, hello, I am Michelangelo. How can I... Uh, wait. Are you here to deliver more billboard requests? Please tell me you're not a messenger on behalf of Mr. House. Uh, of course I act on behalf of Mr. House. Why else would I be here? I am sorry. Meant no offense. The billboards are not ready yet. Please, I need more time. More materials. Hmm. Your failure would not amuse Mr. House, I, unless I be persuaded otherwise. Oh, no, 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 no. Eh, I like this one. Spare parts, assembly tools, generators. Mr. House won't buy your excuse. I should have known that Mr. House wouldn't have sent just anybody. Anything I might offer to, well, encourage discretion. Have you seen the cost of pliers, duct tape, and saws lately? 300 caps should cover it, I suppose. Yeah, I imagine that it takes a lot to fill the void of such a bottomless soul. Take the caps and leave me to my sorrows. Uh, 300 caps it is. 
Here, now please leave me be. I've had enough bullying for today. Oh, it's all right. Now that you have all you care for, please leave and don't come back. Oh, right, bugger. Now that you have all you care for, please leave and don't come back. Oh, bugger. Oh, bugger. Now that you have all you care for, please leave and don't come back. Oh, damn my greed. I've broken the quest. Oh, crap. That's not good. Hello. Excuse me, but I'm busy. Oh, I was hoping I maybe could talk to you instead. Oh. Bugger, 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 bugger. Right. Please. Leave and don't come back. I'm going to leave the building and see if when I come back he's, you know, fixed. If not, I'll have to reload. That's kind of annoying. I'm hoping perhaps the, uh, the, 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 I'm, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm just saying maybe quick quest designer, maybe you could have taken that into account. Because I may have just broken it completely now. Why is it boy on? No, it's not. Why does it feel like there's a light? Oh, it's from this. All right. Um. Welcome back. Need anything? Not. Sh nope. Nope. Where are you? You blithering. Where's he gone? The devil is he upstairs or something? Yeah, he must be. Yeah, he's up there somewhere. Come on, you. Now that you have all you. Oh, <laughs> leave and don't come back. Nah. Will that fail the quest? Will that fail it? Will that fail it? Um, apparently not. No, that's really dodgy. Alright, well, that was fun. I certainly enjoyed that, but meanwhile, in an alternate universe... <sighs> Let's go and try that again, shall we? Oh, where is he? Oh, there he is. Michelangelo, pleased to meet you. Oh. Hello, I am Michelangelo. How can I... Uh, wait. Are you here to deliver more billboard requests? Please tell me you're not a messenger on behalf of Mr. House. Uh, I'm not here for anything like that. Who are you? That's great to hear. Really great. I'm Sheldon from Vault 21, although here I go by my artistic name, Michelangelo. So what brings you here? Um, uh, you, uh, an artist, a rare thing to see. What's your story? Well, I, uh, not much, really. Vault 21 was my home. My dear home. I left it to explore the outside world. At first it was a marvel to behold. My inspiration flowed true and its works caught Mr. House's attention. That's how I ended up in this place. Uh, it sounds as if you don't like this place. What's wrong with it? I feel haunted by something terrible. Working in such a huge workshop often makes me shiver. I can't even leave the strip. Uh, so this fear of the outside is draining your inspiration somewhat. Yes, I think so. But please, uh, keep quiet about it. Without inspiration, I'm as good as a tumbleweed drifting in the barren wasteland. Uh, no, we've been down that route already. <laughs> Uh, that's, uh, I, I have it on the tip of my t I, Agoraphobia. I'll help. Maybe you were thinking of agoraphobia? Yes, you are right. I need something to bring back my inspiration. Any ideas? 
Mm, so four years of psychoanalysis and a few thousand caps a month will fix you. Uh, you go to check on it. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I know why they want a pig, but I don't know if it's gonna break the fucking dialogue again. Um, well, I know this chap in Freeside really good at trepanation. You'd be amazed how he. Stop right there. I'm sorry, but there is nothing wrong with my brain. What I need is something that inspires ideas back into my work. Well, uh. But just grow a pair and go out to the real world to find your inspiration, why don't you? I... what does this have to do with my... Never mind. I just can't go outside, get it? There has to be another way. Oh, several years of psychoanalysis and a few thousand caps a month will probably fix you. What? Are you serious? I am an artist. I need inspiration, not therapy. I could escort you into the wasteland, I suppose. It's not so bad. Thank you for the offer, but I think I really can't go to see... Wait a minute. I know, I don't have to necessarily be there to see it. What do you mean? Yes, yes, that's it. I have a camera. It is old, but it should work. Perhaps you could bring me images of inspiring landmarks. Oh. Oh, I'm tired of this other culture just beat you senseless. No, 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 no. We're not that classless, are we? Mickey, photography's a risky business, oh boy. It's going to cost you a lot. There's an opportunity for profit anywhere, huh? Even if it means preying on the helpless. Okay, you shuckster. 150 caps each if they're good. I'm glad we have an understanding. Now, do you have any landmarks in mind? I've always wanted to see the dinosaur and its thermometer sign at Novak. Then there's the famous Bison Steve sign. The McCarran Airfield and the Helios One power station signs are of much interest to my work. Like the Sunset Sarsaparilla headquarters bottle. Uh, Alright, you've got a deal. I'll return with the pictures, I suppose. Thank you. I really can't thank you enough for this. Please, get me all the pictures. I'll compensate you accordingly. Oh, and if you need more camera film, then just come back and I'll get it for you. Again, thank you. Kodak R9000 added. 24 camera films added. Alright, I can't just go around taking holiday snaps, and I suppose. I just want to come back here and get more film. Alright then, everybody, let's go. Out of the way. I'm going to go take some pictures of the wasteland, apparently. Uh... Oh, good heavens. Alright, let's just go. Let's just... Hang on a minute. How are they going to... Oh. Oh, okay. Never mind. Um, hey. right. Hey. So, got to go and take a bunch of pictures of the wasteland. Mostly places I've already been to anyway, so I know where to go. It's no big deal. We've killed everything in those areas anyway. Everything unfriendly, anyway. So that is not a problem. So, let's see. Take his pictures for him. So that's... Oh, bugger. He doesn't actually say... It doesn't actually... It hasn't actually noted down what he wants me to take pictures of, has it? Well, he, okay, let me see. Sunset Sarsaparilla Headquarters Bottle. The Dinky the Dinosaur thermometer thing, and the Bison Steve, I think. Was that, were those the three? Uh, might have been another one. I don't know. Well, never, blah, whatever. Yeah. Well, yeah. Oh, well, mm. Anyway. It's a bloody good thing I record these, isn't it? <laughs> Go back and check. <laughs> anyway. So, what are we going to do now? That's the question. Um, I think, oh, no, here we go. It's a it's separate quest type, type of thing. Okay. Sunset Sarsaparilla Headquarters Bottle sign. Yeah. Helios 1 sign. McCarran Airfield sign. 
Bison Steve sign. Novak Dinosaur Thermometer. Very good. Okay. Gotta go back to Randall with Alex's finger. Yeah, what a what a charming gentleman he was. Uh gonna bring that finger back to uh back to Randall. That was that strange the bunker we want to try and get into at some point. I forget exactly how we were gonna find out though. We need to find some more entertainers for the tops. You know, at our leisure. Probably should go and see if Nina's still alive at some point. I guess when we're gonna take that photo of the dinosaur. Um Yeah, well go say hello to Paul, because I think he's yeah, he's got my garden all set up. And Take Rex to Dr. Henry in Jacob's town. Yes, yes, Rex, that's right. Your brain hurts, and then we thought we need to go and fix it. Um, Jerry, the followers will. Accept. Oh, God, you know what? If I ever happen to wander back into uh, Red Rock Valley or whatever the bloody hell it's called, yeah, maybe I'll maybe I'll take care of that one. Fine, Bill Ronte. Another hobo that needs sorting out. I oh, have better things to do. Things that go boom. Oh yeah, go and say hello to the boomers. Bestus, yeah, sunset, size brother, star cap, whatever. Track down Durable Dunn's caravan with Cass. I keep thinking I've done that one, but I haven't, have I? I really should do that at some point. And, oh yeah, we need to go rummaging around in the ruins for heads of people I've already shot. Oh bugger, never mind. Oh, yeah, we need to go investigate Spear's Cavern with Russell, don't we? Yeah. Oh, and bug an access point to the Lucky 38's Day Network, which I still haven't decided whether or not I want to do, because it seems like it might be a silly way to get myself killed. Uh. Oh, and of course, yeah, at some point we need to go and say hello to Caesar over at Fortification Hill, something I'm not terrifically looking forward to, I must be honest. Um, right now, right now, right about now, I think, uh, well, let's see, the McCarran, McCarran Airport's not too far from here, is it? So, I think we can go and, um, we can go take a photo of that. Right now, right about now, without too much bother, I, re I imagine. Really, the goggles and the face mask, strictly speaking, necessary on the Vegas Strip. But whatever. Just lost on months caps. <sighs> God, I thought you were Ringo there for a minute. No, nope, you just look a lot like him, except you have glasses. Yeah, McCarran... Uh He's over there again. Look. Like a strip of clones. Bloody hell. Anyway. Alright, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. The Karen Airfield is. Hmm, well, it's a bit of a walk, I suppose. Where did I put the van? Can we just drive there? I reckon we can probably just drive there, can't we? I don't think that's an issue. I fancy handing over this finger. It's starting to go off a bit. Doesn't smell very nice, frankly, and I, I'm gonna go hand that over to hand that over to Randall, I think, before it turns into a finger bone. Ah, there you are. Jolly marvellous. Okay, well, let's yeah, we have to go around the back, don't we? Oh, good heavens, this is gonna be a barrel of laughs getting you all of you lot in here, isn't it? Oh dear. My god, you haven't turned into all black shadow creatures of the night. That's unusual. Normally you, uh... I wonder if that was some sort of... We'll see if that happens again but in, in the future, but I wonder if that was... Because uh, I haven't... Last time I played this, I had a different graphics card with different drivers, and I wonder if that's what that was the whole time. Huh. Let me just hold all this crap away. There we go. Yeah, I wonder if that was it. I have a GTX 980 now, you see. And before I was using the old, the old 780. And with all the drivers, etc, etc. 
so. Uh, incidentally, I think this will be the first 60 FPS video I've done in the New Vegas series, won't it? Yeah, yeah I think it is. Jolly good. Anyway then, alright, so. Camp McCarran. Please tell me you're here somewhere. There you are. Yes, the noisiest van in all of uh, Nevada. Yeah, Nevada. I've been told. I've since learned that apparently you're supposed to pronounce it Nevada. Not Nevada. Nevada. I'm going to call it Nevada, though. Because Nevada just sounds silly unless you're from Nevada. Alright then, well. The Karen Airport. Las Vegas. It's definitely seen better days, doesn't it? Definitely. Right, anyway, uh, so this, uh, what, do, what does he want me to photograph? This? Or what? A Karen Airfield sign. That looks like the sign to me, but I could be wrong. Let's have a look at the magic compass. It's pointing me this way. I think. Gosh, you know I completely forgot that we even have to eat and drink and stuff like that. I just saw that on the right side of the screen and was like, bloody hell. Radiation is 17%. Apparently, I don't think that's too bad. It's not, it's in, you know, it's in green, yeah. 171 rads. How much rad away have I got? 9. 18 rad X. Oh yeah, of course, I went through a shed load of a rad away when we went through Yucca Mountain and... And there was that place with the ghouls and... Oh dear. Yeah. Okay... I don't recall there being a big sign out here at all, but... Oh! Oh, right, yeah, it's a big neon sign. Okay, that makes... I'm supposed to just want me to take a photo of that. That's like the... That's like the iconic... Welcome to Las Vegas sign, isn't it? Really? Oh, good God. Apparently it's over. Nice pistol! Yikes, look at that thing. Just to forget the signs for a minute. Is that no? That is oh, is it? Just, it's just a regular forty-four, isn't it? It just for some reason it looked a bit different. I've got a better gun than that. Where is it? I've got I've got this. <laughs> that never gets old. But I've also got uh, not that. This! Like a hunting revolver, which I've barely used at all, but look at it, it's gorgeous. Oh, for heaven's sake, I forgot about those ridiculous animations. That was a terrible idea installing those. Oh well, I'm too lazy to get rid of them now. Well, the aim animation is not so bad, it's just. Uh... Hurt the ones we care about the most. Although, a gun that big, I, I think you might. might... Ideally, you really want to be gripping that with two hands. I'm just saying, but uh, it's that pose, is that there that I, I just sort of can't help but giggle a little bit at. But never mind, we're not in third person 90% of the time anyway, so I guess who, who really gives a damn? Um, the caravan trader. Damn, oh, God. Crap everywhere. Well, you're in the wrong occupation for someone who really can't deal with Brahmin dung, aren't you? Bean leaders shouldn't have messed with our great army. 
Oh, I was. Mormon caravan from New Canaan came through the other day. Very fascinating. I was hoping I could trade with you, but I guess not. Anyway, moving on. Sign. Right. Have you got a laser gun? You've got a laser gun. You've got a laser rifle. Nice laser rifle. I'm with you now? Oh, okay. Fine. We won't go quietly. The Legion can count on that. No, very good. Laser rifles are big and loud. Anyway, so. When you do die, you'll make a lot of noise. What have you got? Oh, it's just a service rifle. How dreadfully dull. Anyway. So, I'm guessing, I'm guessing we want a photo of this. Probably. Yeah. Alright then, well, you know what, chaps and chapettes. Why don't you just... Everyone in front of here. Come on, everyone. Everyone over here. I'll get you in the photo as well. Why not? I want, hopefully I can get a... You know, get another one developed. That I can keep. Hey. Just, oh, for heaven's sake. Do you, are you lot really just... Yeah. We had this issue when we were back in the uh, the tops, didn't we? When we tried to take that group photo. It just it took forever to get you guys to sort of really... Kind of... Understand the concept of a photograph. Really, I just... I do love that. That's Kodak with a C. Good old alternate timelines. Yeah, Veronica, over over here, my dear. Come on. There you go. That is about as good as it's going to get, clearly. D stay put, Russell. For heaven's sake, man. Back there. Back, back, back. 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 Just personal space, and also, it's a photograph. So stay bloody put. Alright, except I don't think I can get you all in the... I need a wider lens, don't I? Flippin' heck. Oh, good lord, look at that. Oh, gee. What if I... Uh, in, mm. How about that can we get without this sort of not counting, you know what I mean? Just... Uh, just oh, Christ, say... Say Brahmin cheese, everybody. I think I did the trick. There we go. Very nice. Ain't the first time somebody's pointed a weapon at me. Get over it. I was going to say this isn't a weapon, Russell, but, you know, if I smack him around the head hard enough, it might just be. Come to think of it, why on earth would I or anyone else want to photograph with your ugly fucking face in it, eh? You know, anyone other than the police, I suppose. Bad motherfucker's prettier than you are, and that's saying a lot. Ugh. Why am I on toast over there? No, I just, I, I forget it. You know what, we'll take another one. Get out of the way, you. Come on, shove off. Over here. There we go. That's more like it. Um. Beautiful, beautiful. Veronica, this way, my dear. Come on. No, you're just going to stare lovingly into bad motherfucker's eyes. Okay, fair enough. There we go. That'll do it. Lovely. We've got 22 more bits of film. So, no worries. Anyway. Um... Let's see. Yeah, well, let's look at this. All right, well, that's done. Photo tours of the Mojave with David Crumpington. I like it. I do really. I, I can I get more film off of him after we've done this because I hope we can. I want to take more photographs. It's going to be excellent. Have a whole album. It'd be magnificent. I mean, I do wonder where he's going to get these developed. I did not see, you know, uh, uh, you know. Because he's got a dark room somewhere, I suppose. Someone must have one somewhere. How on earth else did we get that group photograph, come to think of it? Yeah, you know what, Russell? You just stay in the toilet. And, you know, okay, you've all become shadow creatures of the night again once more. Very good. So it wasn't the graphics card issue, it's just a New Vegas is weird issue. Alright, uh, let's see then. So... Um... We could drive on down back to Novak, say hello to Niner, and then take the photograph. 
but we really don't have the room for Niner at the moment with everyone dra we're dragging around at the moment, so I think maybe forget about that. Let's just go straight back to uh, Prim, so we can hand over this rotting finger. Ingenious, this, this, this contraption, that you can drive without any input whatsoever. What? I don't know what, what on earth kind of gear stick that's supposed to be. I suppose maybe it's not even a gear stick, it looks more like some sort of throttle, considering there aren't any actual pedals. Ugh, good. Very strange indeed. Anyway, um... Excuse me, everybody. Just... Drink while we're here. Have I got anything in the fridge? No, it's, it's, it's completely empty. Oh, forsooth, the cupboard is bare. Deary me. Oh, hello. What's that? Oh, boot face. Very good. Which is my power fist? Which hockey? It wasn't that one. Oh, that's the change ammo hockey. We don't want that. There's that, that, that. Seriously? I don't have hockey with my power fist? What's going on? Alright. Power fist. You can be number seven. Number eight is stim pack, evidently. There we go. That seems to fix boot face, so, you know. Grand opening. Lucky 38 Hotel. Las Vegas, Nevada. Gamora Hotel still popular. A legacy starts. The Lucky 38 hotel ribbon is cut. Citizen worried about electricity shortages. Ugh, well, you know. Electricity bills. Electricity bills never change. Hello, Prim. How do? How are things? Still pretty dreadful? I thought so. Chin up, everyone! The powder gangs are all dead. Well, not all dead, but all the ones that were here are dead. Uh, do you reckon the NCR would pay me to just go and level the powder gang as prison? Just completely, just, just tons and tons of explosives, I'm talking. Just massive explosives. Boom! All of them gone. The whole place. Just rubble. Oh, for heaven's sake, people! Somebody cleaned up poor Daniel here. For heaven's sake! I, he's, how long has he been? He's lying out here? He's preserved remarkably well, isn't he? Considering he's been lying around here in this heat for weeks. For goodness sake! R Ruby! Come on! Let the poor fella rest in peace. For heaven's sake! Cremate him or bury him or whatever, just do something. Even I buried Benny for heaven's sake. Can we? No, I didn't mean to do that at all. Oh. Go on, Daniel. Oh, you do actually reek, but oh, no one else is going to do this apparently. Ugh. I'm not meaning to slam you in at walls here, mate. It's just, you know, it's just the way this works. Oh, good heavens, what are we going to do with you? Uh. I suppose we could dump you around. I have really no idea. I really need to bury you, but there's nothing I can do, ultimately. Other than just sort of... I don't know. Uh, I just, I really truly dislike the way you seem to be dancing every time I whip you around there. That's, uh, uh, that's actually horrifying. You know what? You can just stay here on this car for now. I'll figure out something later. Oh dear. You lot should be ashamed of yourselves. I can't believe we're opening a casino in your town. You don't deserve it. <sighs> Ew! I don't want to touch the sticky body. <sighs> I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna just. Uh... You're all terrible, and you should feel terrible. I 
Now just, just watch as I go and hand over this severed finger <laughs> to, a, to a bounty hunting office. Because, morally speaking, I am so dreadfully squeaky clean, aren't I? Oh, yes. Well, my Pip Boy seems to think so, you know. I, who am I to argue with the mighty Pip Boy? It's, uh, it seems fairly convinced. Really? Ah, uh, if I can find the page with it on. Um, oh dear. Uh, general... Hey, look! Very good! Shepherd! That's me! Jesus! Basically! That's me! Argue not with the mighty pit boy! I... I'm... I'm a good fellow! I'm... I'm a... I'm a... Charitable gentleman! Am I not? See? I... I go walk, go around... I... I... yeah. What do you mean I should start calling my pit boy Jiminy Cricket? I don't know what you're on about. Don't be, don't, shut, don't be absurd. Shut up. Anyway, how do I make you all sh stop? I can't remember the button. Was it that? No. Was it that? No. That? No. Oh, God, that did something. Wait here. Be aggressive. Uh, towards our enemies. I don't mean like be just horribly aggressive or passive aggressive towards me. That would, you know, mind you, we have enough of that already. Randall, my dear fellow, I'm gonna have a seat. Is that okay? Wonderfully chipper fellow, isn't so, he? So, is Alex dead yet? Extremely. I know it's been a while. Good. Here's a reward, whether you want it or not. I'm getting some very interesting contracts. Come back when you're ready to pursue them. Whether you want it or not, oh, you, you, you charming fellow. I've got more contracts if you're ready to go. Absolutely. All right, this next job is in Novak. Over the past few weeks, someone or something has snatched up several children from the town. The abductions always take place at night, and so far there's only one witness he's far from credible. His name is Ricky. He's a jet fiend who wanders around Novak doing odd jobs, but is generally regarded as a shiftless buffoon. Nonetheless, dumbass Ricky is the only lead we have right now. See if you can pry some information out of him. The citizens of Novak are just about panicked over this, so get out there and bag the creep responsible. I can already tell this is just going to be such a pleasant job, isn't it? It's just going to be absolutely bloody wonderful. Everything seems to want to drag me over to Novak at the minute. It's just destiny is pulling me in that fateful, sodding direction. <sighs> I'm going to Good Springs first. I'm going to have to brace myself for this. I'm going to have a look at my nice garden and water the plants and that sort of thing. And I'm going to be, it's going to be very nice. I'll have to sit down and have a nice Sunday lunch and... Yes, and then I'll go and deal with the child-murdering psychopath that is inevitably waiting in Novak. Oh. Today was going so well, you know?